I am Anil Kumar sharing with you a test problem. Here is a thinking question on properties of graph of functions. Draw a possible graph that fits the situation. Write equation to represent your graph. Right. So we have two things to do. First to draw the graph and then to write the equation of that graph. Description is a discontinuous odd function whose domain is x belongs to real numbers and range is y belongs to or f of x belongs to real numbers. So as far as domain and range is concerned it is set of all real numbers. Uh, but the function should be discontinuous. So that is the criteria. Discontinuous and odd. How can you sketch such a function? Well, if it is an odd function and discontinuous function, what we can do is, this is one possible solution. I'm just making four dots here to help me draw a good graph. So we can take a function, uh, let us say y equals to x. So we'll take combination of few functions. So let us say y equals to x will be kind of a line like this, right? And if we break it in between, so we have a line like this going, going like this. And let us say the points which we have here are 1 and minus 1. This is also 1 for us, minus 1. So, so this is the odd function. Now in between, since we have a domain which is continuous and range is also continuous what we can do is we can combine it with another function where we can have a hole here right at 1 and minus 1 and join it with another diagonal line why am I using diagonal lines through origin because the function should be odd function that is kind of very critical to understand this is a very interesting question and I hope this video helps you in understanding the concept and if you get it in test you will be thanking me for that now let us write on the equation for this function I hope you understand that this is odd since it is symmetric it has a rotational symmetry about origin right now well, we can write this function as a piecewise function so maybe three pieces so first piece is from minus infinity uh, minus infinity to uh, let us say minus 1 so we can say when we can say like this when x is less than we'll include this point on this side so less than equal to minus 1 in that case f of x is equals to x and we have seen if x is greater than or equal to plus 1 even then it is x in between we have having minus value so minus of x when x is greater than minus 1 and less than plus 1 so that function actually represents odd function with domain and range as all real numbers right and a discontinuous function I hope you appreciate it. Thank you and all the best.